welcome back to my channel. For today, we're gonna to be having a fun and exciting video. We're gonna do a whole cooking with me. You have been asking for this for quite some time, probably a good six months. So I'm finally getting around to doing it. I've been sharing here and there in a couple of like my vlogs, what I eat in a day, some meals, and you guys are just all about it, want to see what I eat, what I make, and today's video is actually sponsored by Green Chef's meal kit delivery system. It comes right to your door. It's going to have all the ingredients you're going to need to prepare each meal, making it easy and simple. And what actually separates them from other type of meal-based companies is that everything has different types of dietary needs. So if you are keto, if you are vegan, gluten-free, they're definitely going to have options for you and you can select exactly what you're looking for to be delivered right to your home. Personally for me, I am in my third trimester of pregnancy, so it is really important that I stick to a healthy diet. The baby has full taste buds now. Anything that goes into my mouth goes into the baby's mouth, but I'm not gonna lie, you guys, I am so tired at this point. So to be over the stove top and in the oven and prepping meals that are gonna take me an hour or more is just not realistic at this point. So these meals will take you approximately 40 minutes or less to do, depending on the one that you choose. This is perfect. It's gonna be easy for you to make meals as well as clean up afterwards so not only will they include all the items you're going to need in your box but also you will have the recipe cards so these are great to be able to follow easy instructions and know exactly what you're getting for tonight we are going to be doing the pork tenderloins with balsamic fig sauce sounds so delicious this only takes 30 minutes to make it's 510 calories and it is gluten free it also will be with a side of mashed potatoes and roasted herb seasoned carrots I'm so excited to try this out it's making me hungry just looking at the picture on the recipe card so I know this is gonna be something we're really going to enjoy and for those of you that are looking to try out Green Chef I will have a coupon code pop up here on the screen as well as down in the description bar or link for you to follow this is a great opportunity to try them out because you get to get some delicious meals while also scoring it at a great price. Be sure to thumbs up this video if you guys enjoy watching these types of videos. Hit that little subscribe button so you don't miss out on my future ones and I will talk to you in my next one. Bye. All right, so it is time to get cooking. So we have our pork tenderloins. We have our bag here that comes labeled so you know exactly which meal to take out on that night. All the ingredients are inside our recipe card as I previously showed you guys and on the back of it, it has everything step by step so you can follow the directions, making it super simple and easy. You don't need to be like a premium chef to make these, so that's always great. So we're gonna dive right into the bag and take all of our ingredients out. And I'm going to use the top of my kitchen island just as like my cooking surface. This is where I always prep all of my meals. our figs, our seasoning, carrot, organic yellow onions, as well as our all organic balsamic vinegar sauce. So everything as you can see is labeled right here so you know exactly what's inside and what you need. And the first step that we're going to be doing is to preheat the oven to 425 degrees. All right, so step one, I've went ahead and diced all of my potatoes as it mentioned. Now I have my medium sized pot. We're going to fill it with water and we're going to bring that to a boil. Next up 
this time for our carrots. I'm just gonna cut the ends, peel them, and then slice them up. So we just diced up our carrots, now it is time for our dried figs. I'm gonna take them out of the packaging, cut off the ends, and then same thing, just dice them into small pieces. So we have our diced carrots, diced figs. The next step is going to be step three, which is to roast the carrots. So we're gonna place them in a medium-sized bowl and then drizzle with the ingredients, cooking oil, salt, pepper, rosemary, basil, and sage blend, and then you're gonna coat it. This is from when I cooked dinner last night and washed the dishes. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna put the carrots in here. I'm going to season them and then put them on a cookie sheet. That's why we preheated the oven was for the carrots. Alright, so we have our roasted carrots. These are now ready to go into the oven. Alright, so the oven's reached 425 and is now ready to go in. And these are going to roast for 12 to 15 minutes. So I'm just taking my medium sized pan, I'm going to bring it to medium heat and then we're going to saute about 5-10 minutes each side the pork tenderloins that I already seasoned. Alright, so I've placed the pork tenderloins into the oven and now I'm just taking my figs and the onions and we're going to be sauteing it with some salt and pepper. Alright, while the onions and figs are sauteing, I'm just going to get started on the mashed potatoes, draining the water and then just adding in some salt and some water to it. I'm just taking the balsamic vinegar sauce and we're gonna pour all of that in along with two tablespoons of water. For my potatoes, I'm just mashing them up and I'm going to be adding some salt and pepper. Things 
almost done. I'm just plating it all, the carrots, the mashed potatoes, the pork loins and everything, and I'll show you guys after, and of course, my taste test. <laughs> So the meal is all cooked. It looks so good, smells so good. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a taste test for you guys. So I'm gonna take a little bit of mash, some carrots. This fig with onion looks so good. And then we'll take a piece of the pork as well. So I get a little bit of everything in my first bite. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like shaking my head and stuff like that. It's really, really good. I think the onions and the figs add like the perfect type of sweetness to it. And then everything else, the mashed potatoes, they're nice and creamy. The carrots, everything just came out really good. So I would highly suggest trying this out, you guys, if you haven't yet. This now completes my cook with me. I hope you enjoyed watching. Thumbs up if you guys wanna see more cook with me videos on different recipes, different meals. We could do bake with me's. Whatever you'd like to see, let me know down in the comments and I will talk to you all in my next one. Bye.